In the far north of South Australia, on the shores of Cuddytunda Lake Eyre, a remarkable natural event is unfolding at Australian Wildlife Conservancy's Kalamurna Wildlife Sanctuary. Located at the intersection of three of Australia's central deserts, Kalamurna captures a large ecologically significant area of the Lake Eyre catchment. They call this a dry flood because we haven't had actually any on-ground rain this year. And last year we only received 29.4 mil rain. In late January and early February, heavy rain fell in northwestern Queensland, generating a surge of floodwaters more than a thousand kilometres from the desert river systems of Kalamurna. For over two months, these floodwaters have navigated their way down the Diamantina River system, passing Birdsville and filling Goiter's Lagoon in South Australia. In mid-March, the floodwaters entered the Warburton Creek system, finally arriving on Kalamurna. As the water meanders through Kalamurna, it converges with both the Kalakupa Creek and the Macumba River, before flowing into Cuddytunda Lake Eyre. More than 65% of the water that enters Cuddytunda Lake Eyre, Australia's largest lake, passes through Kalamurna. The sanctuary protects a remarkable 679,000 hectares of desert in the heart of Australia, providing a vital link from Cuddytunda Lake Eyre National Park to the Mungatiri Simpson Desert Regional Reserve. This conserves an area that is bigger than Tasmania. These floodwaters bring new life to Kalamurna and the wildlife it supports, filling waterholes and bringing new growth to the lignum and cooler bars that garden the creek system. Protected through science-informed land management, this sanctuary remains a stronghold for several threatened and declining mammal species, including the crest-tailed Mulgara and the dusky hopping mouse. This is when Kalamurna is at its most dramatic. The floodwaters attract an enormous variety of water birds. Tens of thousands of pelicans, ibis, spoonbills, waders and many species of duck congregate along the Warburton Creek floodplains. As the floodwaters navigate their way to Cuddytunda Lake Eyre, they bring vital nourishment to the only area along this incredible river system that is protected and managed for conservation. Kalamurna Wildlife Sanctuary.